Hi everybody, Michelle Ratowski here with Daytona Fit Mom. Thanks for tuning in on this Tuesday. I just wanted to take a minute to recap this past blog series. If you haven't followed it, um, just listen to the recap and go back and read the different blogs. And if you have been following it, um, thank you so much for following me and being a part of this series. Um, non-traditional sports for kids think outside the box so the reason why I did this was because um, you know what we all know the more common more popular type kids sports and not every kid is maybe into those and it might not mean that they're not athletic and they're not into sports it just might not be their cup of tea so thinking outside the box and trying to educate everybody about some other sports, and I didn't touch into all of them. I, I touched into four. Um, we did BMX, we did baton, and we did run club. So maybe I did three. Um, I did competitive cheer a while ago. I can I can include that blog in this as well. So that would be four. Um, just because competitive cheer is different than your everyday cheer that most kids know about. Most kids know about your pop warner, like your football cheer when you're younger. Um, but all-star competitive cheer is different. So I'll include that too. But um, first was BMX racing. Um, all ages can start. You can start when you're two years old. So there's a blog about the BMX racing. Um, baton or twirling some call it and again I think you can start that as young as two so we talked about that in one of the blogs and um, both of those we interviewed some moms and got their perspective on the sport for their kids as well and then we did run club um, or run series so a lot of us that have younger kids um, you know you don't get into cross country and stuff I think until junior high sorry I just aged myself middle school or high school um, but there are run clubs available and run series for younger kids so you can start that as well and that was in the third blog and um, it's so pretty out today sorry the birds are distracting me I'm sitting outside but um but yeah so those are some of the sports um some other ones I didn't really get into too much for kids um, but you can get into archery lessons um, and you can get into surfing or stand-up paddleboard and someone even mentioned ice skating which is more of your non-traditional um, more of our traditional sports would be like your baseball your football t-ball soccer basketball karate gymnastics dance golf tennis swimming but not everybody's really into those so if you try you know if you have a kid who isn't into any of those sports um, maybe try a couple of the other ones that we've covered in this series so thank you for tuning in and I would love for you to share this with any other parents as well it's getting a little windy out here so I am gonna tune off for the day um, thanks again for tuning in Daytona Fit Mom have a great day